and welcome back to another video. Before we get uh, started, we're just going to um, show the last game on my Legend run. Don't want to give away the result too much, but um, yeah, needless to say, we uh, had a tough run, but we finally got there. Um, really rough switch in here. Going to throw the Shadow Ball and hope for the best. Um, goes down there. We'll come back in with the A-bomb and see what he wants to do. Get a bit of extra um, energy here um, before KOing. Having to shield. And just throw now. We've almost got another Powdered Snow, so the uh, Toxicroak was a terrible lead, but now we can threaten it because we've got a Weather Ball ready to go. So we'll throw here. And then we'll uh, get back into the Azu, and he's let that go, so that definitely helps us. And he's gone straight in with the Sableye. Let's see what he plans on doing here. Um, we're going to throw the play rough, and let's see if he decides to shield. No, he doesn't. So I probably thought it was an Ice Beam and could tank it. And the Toxie comes back in. He was probably thinking, tank the, uh, tank the Ice Beam, get to the return, force the shield, and then... Um, sludge the Azu on the other end but that's not going to happen here and we're going to take the take the game it's going to be pretty tight but the bubble damage now is putting the pressure on he's going to have to throw so he throws now and we should be able to powder snow down we've got plenty of health it's just a matter of uh, if he gets to a mud bomb and the a bomb comes through so um with that claim our rewards and got to legend so Pretty stoked to finally get there. It means we can let our hair down. And um, as the video suggests, we're going to be doing a um, a few little experimental videos. And the first one we've got is uh, we're going to be running Shadow Politoed. Got a decent one, so I thought I'd give it a run. It's running um, Earthquake as the um, limited move that you'll need an uh, Elite TM for. We're going to be running it with Shadow Marwal, um, which I built a little while ago been keen to give it a bit more of a run and we're going to be running it with nine tails with powder snow weatherborne dazzling gleam so definitely a high damage sort of um spammy type team so we'll just see how it goes so first game here absolutely shocking lead uh we'll go into the marwile and they've gone into licky so this is actually really good for us we've got the nine tails in the back and that can definitely take care of the uh victory ball and because we've got Power Up Punch here and Fire Fang just does a ton of damage, um, we should be able to win switch back. We'll have to shoot one Body Slam. Uh, it is resisted, but Marwal is very, very flimsy Pokemon. Um, but it's super fun to use, and we'll just rev up the Fire Fang now. And we should be able to farm down. Um, we'll take this Body Slam and then farm down. But hopefully what we can do here is on the other end is build up a bit of energy and maybe for get that shield back so we'll see if we can what are they going to come in with here okay so it's uh g fisk right we'll be able to get this power up punch off we're already revved up a little bit so we're already going pretty well there all right so we get this one through and yeah the ma the um g fisk is basically almost dead so that's worth a shield in itself it does have a little bit of energy uh this will be an earthquake um, but it is resisted. Oh, sorry, it's new. It's only neutral, and it can definitely take one. Um, I th don't think we got KO'd there. No, we didn't. We got out just in time, and I think we've got a weather ball loaded, so um, looking reasonably good here, but I'm tipping that the um, Nine Tails about to finish this off here. His Sloop Blade to do a fair bit of damage, so we'll shield here. Should be able to farm down from here. Um, yep. Now it's got a shield, but we've got a weather ball. And they've, their win con now, having thrown all their energy with that earthquake, is to um, actually farm down. And we get to another weather ball. So, very nice win there. And yeah, basically a hard wall, terrible lead. Got flipped nicely. All right, we'll go into the next game here. Um, good lead. Super good lead. Um, they go into Sableye. Uh, we go into Ninetales. Now, keep in mind, I haven't use these teams before so um, in the next coming videos you're going to see a lot of mistakes a lot of ways you probably can see that um, I could play things better um, but they, it's literally just giving teams a go and just seeing what sticks so uh, shielded the return there which is super good he won't be able to get to another move we'll throw the weather ball once we've doubled up um, and things are looking reasonably good now 
were able to uh, maintain switch. Now, um, the issue here will be, do we let ourselves get farmed down and just get a little bit of chip on the Basti? Or do we keep this mod in play? Because we've got two good answers in the back for Basti, we're swapping out. And we've got a little bit of energy on the nine tails, so in reasonably good shape, depending on what's in the back here. So we'll just do our thing and start revving up with power-up punches. We'll be able to shield this, and he won't get to another move. Um, he's gone into Medicham here, so not amazing. This would just be a power-up punch. Um, yeah, so we'll throw here. We're definitely getting a lot of chip damage off, and we've still got the Polytoad in the back, so we're okay in that regard, and we'll be able to get the Nine Tails in. Pretty sure it's got at least one Weather Ball. Not quite. Hopefully we can get to the weather ball. And we're throwing here. Let's see if he decides to let this go. I reckon he'll shield this. And he's got some energy. And he's throwing, so it was CMP. That's super good. Um, get into the Politoed. And it's only power up punch. Um, get into the Politoed here. Grab the other shield. Um, and then it's pretty much a race to the move to see what happens. So he shields there. Licking away. We're at the move. And good switch. He's gone back into the Basti. Um, we're just uh, chipping it down. Probably a slight too far under charge, but we've still got plenty of um, room to work with here, so we'll keep going. Um, and we're getting to the move now. And uh, and then, yeah, we've uh, got just enough left for the Medicham, so that worked out quite well. Just good energy management there, and, uh, yeah, Polytoad getting it done. All right, so next game here, um, Nine Tails. Pretty neutral sort of a lead. They've swapped first into their own Politoed here and gotta say, don't really have an amazing answer. So we're just gonna stay in here and uh, see what's what. They've let that one go, probably thinking that we um, didn't have the uh, the Elite TM to move there and unfortunately we do for them. Uh, we've shielded a Weather Ball, which was probably not amazing. So we'll let this one through, definitely a Weather Ball and we can then KO here. And we're back to where we began, so managed to get rid of that Polito, which was a little bit difficult. What will they bring in here? So they're going into a Azu, and for some reason I've gone into Marwal. Um, probably didn't need to do that. Probably should have just stayed with the Polytoed, and this could be Hydro, and we've let it go through. So, yeah, not amazing. The play probably was to stay with the Polytoad or maybe switch into the Nine Tails, but this team sort of, um, it's kind of like ne fairly neutral towards the Zoomer. And yeah, to be honest, probably should have just stayed in. He's shielded there. And I can't see us winning this one, if I'm going to be honest. Uh, it really does depend on what he's got in, in the back. Oh, that's right, he's got the... Uh, got the nine tails in the back so he's uh, dropped out there we're gonna throw another weather ball here and we're gonna go into our nine tails but it's probably too little too late the Azu's got some energy in the back so all we can do is try and um, yeah we've got no shields here so um, we'll throw here but I'm tipping he's trying to get to the gleam and that's why he's shielded and unfortunately it's CMP so um, didn't time that 100% well. Would have been good if he was at 1 HP. That would have knocked him out. But I don't think we're going to be able to get it done here. Uh, getting to the Gleam. I don't think that's going to quite be enough. And from here, he's likely to just farm down. And I don't think we've got to move on the Polly. No, because we spent it. So, yeah, unfortunately, couldn't get it done there. He saw his win con and he went for it. And that was well played. So, yeah, not a great one there. But team is definitely super fun to use. All right, great lead here. Uh, he's now going to um, Vigoroth. Bit tricky again, but power up punch should do the trick and we can um, ramp, ramp up really fast here. So be handy if we can get away with him just getting one body slam away, but he doesn't, yeah, I think he's gonna get to two here, which should be super annoying. And we're probably gonna have to shield to maintain switch. Um, and that may not be too good for us in the end, but we'll see how we go. So we've had to shield there. He's going to go into Marowak and probably farm us all the way down. 
So a couple of five spins there for him. Going back into Politoed, he switched and uh, we're having to throw another weather ball here just to chip it down. Again, it's a charm poly as well. Uh, sorry, a charm nine tails. We go into ours and we'll have to see what he's going to do here. So he'll throw here. Um, just a weather ball, probably, um, yeah, it was good not to shield there. But it's going to be pretty tight here. I'm not sure we're going to be able to do this one. Um, yep, and now we've got to try and powder snow down, but I don't think we're going to be able to. No, we are. That's very, very lucky. Throw here, but unfortunately the um, fire spin's gone through, so we're only going to get this weather ball off, and we're done there. And so that leaves the poly and the barrowack. It's going to be super tight here, so we're getting our first move away now. He's definitely got more than a Shadow Burns worth of energy. Looks like it was CMP. And we're going to try and outrate, run him to the move here. So we shield. Um, getting to the next move. He's got another one now, and that cleans us up. So, yeah, unfortunately, couldn't quite get it done there. Just some awkward matchups, and obviously, not knowing how to play certain switches and some stuff is killing us here. All right, this one, very nice lead for us. Again, Pelipper's a little bit tricky. Um, so we're going to throw the weather ball here and just see what they decide to do. And they're not shielding. So we're going to go again. Get that one away. And should... not Still not shielding, but we'll go into our Nine Tails now. Uh, even if it's a hurricane, we can definitely survive this. So we'll, we'll do that. And it is hurricane, so... But yeah, let's see what they want to do here. If they shield this weather ball... They could potentially win switch back, but I think they're going to let it go. No? Okay, so we've got a shield here. and But we're more, almost at the move, so I think we can uh, throw here and get the shield. If he wants to do it, no, we're farm down. So, yeah, that's a good good outcome. We'll be able to get a, a weather ball off here and not too much farm, which is really good. So, played that one reasonably well. Bit of guesswork involved. And then uh, we'll be able to come back in with the poly here. But to be perfectly honest, um, oh, and uh, your Venusaur in the back, that's GG's. We'll be able to shield here. Oh, we're letting this one go. That's a frenzy plant. Jeez, that does a lot. But he shouldn't be able to get to another one now. Don't think he'll shield this. Doesn't, but yeah, the, the um, Fire Fangs absolutely demolish Venusaur. And we'll be able to... Can we get to the parrot punch? Not quite, but this thing's so low now. I don't think he can get to where he needs to get to. Probably a rock slide bait. Um, that still does a ton of damage. We're at the weather ball now. I think he's probably halfway to his next rock slide, um, but we'll catch up really quickly here. Don't think we've got to move through. He's throwing rock slide. And we're going to get to the weather ball first here, and we're there. And it looks like they've quit, so they realised what was happening. So team one of our, let's try some new teams. Super fun to use, really spammy. Um, I love Marwal. It's difficult to use, and it's difficult to make good teams for, but I feel like this is a very decent team for it. So um, if you want to have a bit of fun and you've got uh, some decent rank on, give it a go. Thanks for watching.